but we still need to output the total price. So we've calculated it up here, but uh, now we need to come in and say output total car price. Okay, and then there's the end of the module. Okay, we're done with the pseudocode. Let's try to do the test plan. The test plan uh, should have a place for the car model. And uh, since we're going to be running out of room here quickly, uh, we might use a different format, but um, I'm going to do some abbreviations and hope that works. So car model is just going to be CM. Then uh, sunroof and leather seats, uh, custom speakers, and retractable uh, child seat, and convertible. And then on the end, we'll have total, the output of total price. I think it's total car price, actually. Okay, so maybe we'll underline that so it'll be easy to identify it as the uh, column headings, and then we'll come down. And for a car model, let's put in Pluto first. And sunroof, yes. Uh, leather seats, yes. Uh, custom speakers, retractable car seat. And we're going to say no on convertible because we did say yes on sunroof and we're not doing the test for the combination yet. This one should give us a price or an output of total price of um, $21,799.96. Now it's debatable whether we'll get the uh, the punctuation out. There is a function um, that you can use that I've provided in your downloads where you, it's a money function. You can read about that in VBA Explain Part 2. But uh, you don't have to do that. That's optional, this term. So the dollar sign isn't uh, required. The comma isn't required. So you could be okay with that output. This one should have a special price. Special package price message coming out. Um, because um, special package will say message, something to indicate that that message should be coming out here because they chose all four of those uh, extras. Now the next one, let's put in asteroid. We'll say yes on the sunroof. No, no, no. But we'll say yes on convertible. And this is the test that we'll see if it catches the fact that they shouldn't be asking for a sunroof on a convertible. And so our output, instead of total car price, will be not available message. Okay. Next test, we'll just choose Pulsar. And um, yes on sunroof no on leather seats, yes and yes, just to get a mixture here, and no so that we get a valid test and aren't mixing sunroof with convertible. And we should get an answer here that will be, whoops, will be 28,999.97. Finally, let's do one more test. Um, no on sunroof, no, 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 and then no. This should be a base price of $19,000. Okay, that concludes the test plan. Uh, we'll, when we get the program written, we'll enter these values and see if that's what we get.